Hey guys, welcome to the channel and in this video guys I'm going to show you which program I'm using to access my uh, tree mining rigs remotely uh, via my laptop and also my smartphone. I am using a MacBook and an iPhone however you can install it and use it pretty much on all platforms and all phones, uh, smartphones available. Now the program is called TeamViewer. Um, I know a lot of you may come up and say it's not the best an option to go for, it's not the fastest option probably to go for and you could be right so if you do have any suggestions free, uh, feel free to comment down below and I'll be more than happy to obviously look into different programs and if I do find something better I may also switch but in the meantime this is what I'm using I've been using it for quite some time now very easy to install very user friendly it doesn't require a lot of knowledge uh, to do so so I'm not going to go into details how to install and how to set it up however if you do uh, find yourself stuck feel free to obviously ask me and I'm going to do my best to help you out. So, uh, just quickly I'm going to show you, if you go to downloads and you click on Team Viewer, you can clearly see it's available all across Windows, Mac, Linux and so on and so on and all the smartphones, so very very convenient program. Uh, when I'm at home I usually access uh, the rigs via the laptop and when I'm away I just, if I need to, I obviously log in via my iPhone and it, and it is helpful guys, there's been times where I'll log in just to see how things are going and I'll find out that uh, because I'm mining with Claymore, the Claymore has uh, stuck and the rig is not mining so with a click of a button I can restart and obviously get the rig going so it's definitely you know, worth having a program like this. And I'm going to show you here the three mining rigs mining away and here I had to stop all three for a while and early on I just stopped one of them as well, I had to do something on it but as you can see currently they are mining uh, Ethereum, I'm trying to get a one Ethereum and then I see I may switch to uh, Classic and so on if you've been following me you know I'm going between Ethereum Classic and Ethereum, Ethereum Classic and Ethereum trying to get all uh, you know both coins uh, in my wallet so let me show you now the program uh, quickly in use so here it is and as you can see there are my three mining rigs, uh, the 470, the 480 and 580, I call them that because uh, one of them is uh, you know with the Sapphire Nitro RX 470 cards AGB, the other one is with the Sapphire Nitro RX 480 AGB cards and the last one is the MSI RX 580 AGB uh, cards. So, once you set it up, all uh, nice and easy as I said and here I am on my MacBook all I do is click on the rig that I want access, Team Viewer will open, and then I have a full access over the, the rig and the windows. Here it is, mining away. As you can see, currently producing about 166 mega hashes. Uh, as soon as you uh, log in via the Team Viewer, guys, it's been reported that we lose a bit of uh, mega hashes or hashes of, uh, you know, while we are in, but that's all right sometimes you gotta do it. So as I mentioned early on sometimes I will log in and I will see that it's stuck so all I gotta do is uh, you know click on the X and then restart the Ethereum again. Um, I also can uh, and another very useful thing is you can uh, quickly see what is the temperature how, how much the fans are working so for instance here I can see one of them is at 78 which is a bit high uh, but I tell you guys, it's very hot. Having three mining rigs in a flat is damn hot in the summer. So obviously I'm going to have to look into options and maybe move them around different rooms. I don't know. And this is why you see sometimes the rigs, you know, stopping to work because obviously I'm trying different locations for them around the flat. So um, you can see, uh, are the, is the rig working? Uh, what is, in, you know, how many mega hashes is obviously mining away, the temperature, the fans, so very useful. Another thing I like to do with this is uh, obviously I can go into Sapphire Tricks and you know change the memory clock, the GPU clock, undervolt and so on. Very easy to use. Also I use this program by the way for modifying the BIOS so when I was doing the modification on the three rigs I wasn't connecting the rigs to a monitor or to my TV. Um, I was, uh, you know, all I had to do is switch it off from let's say here disconnect the five cards, uh, turn it on obviously from the bottom of the rig, I can't, this, I can't do this remotely, I gotta be next to it, but I do it via the, the team viewer. So once it's on, I do the, you know, the, the editing of the BIOS, restart and all this, 
and very very easy guys so I really didn't need uh, to, to use another monitor or another mouse or another keyboard all done via my laptop very very uh, easy to use very useful guys so here is the 470 let me now show you the 480 uh, there's a pop-up screen as you can see guys that is because uh, this is the free version so it constantly reminds you this was a free session sponsored by by the way I'm not sponsored by TeamViewer I'm using as you can see I haven't paid for it on the free uh, but it, it, the free version doesn't expire so that's very very nice uh, again here is the 480 rig uh, mining away at 100 almost 78 megahertz is close to 180 very good same thing I can quickly look at the temperatures fans how they are working so if I see something I can immediately let's say stop it and so on um, even if you are away by the way and if you let's say see the heating is going too much or anything you can obviously stop it uh, stop first of all the claymore and then if you want you can uh, obviously stop the whole uh, rig right from here and that's as you can see all done remotely guys so uh, let's close this one uh, the 480 and finally let's look at the 580 rig guys so you can see that I'm accessing them all three so the same thing here guys here there is the rig mining away at uh, almost 180 megahashes as well again as I said as soon as you log in you tend to lose a bit um, but overall very good very useful program and I recommend uh, if you do want to remotely access your rigs uh, that this is a very good option to go for again if there's any other suggestions or from you guys that are thinking maybe there's something better out there that is less uh, stressful let's say on the rig and all that feel free to suggest it and I can check you out and of course uh, the people who are watching this video and reading the comments can also check you out but this is what I'm using and as you can see it's doing a very very good job so I'm gonna close this one and 580 done so there you have it guys uh, let's put this down so yeah so far so good a very very good uh, program and very very easy to use now before we go guys let's uh, before I go I should say so let's look at the market because it's going very well uh, let, let me refresh uh, so yeah here it is Bitcoin at almost uh, 2850 Ethereum very well at 2006 uh, sorry uh, well I wish 2000 it may, it may one day by the way Ethereum at $260 Ethereum Classic at 17.69 Litecoin at 30 Dash at 146 Strat is a coin a lot of people are talking lately uh, 1044 Monero at 51 uh, Digibyte doing very well as well uh, very well and I think you know if you're thinking of something to invest you may want to look into that why wow, is cheap um, Golem is another one uh, uh, Sia coin as well in fact uh, if you do have a mining rig you can dual mine Ethereum and Sia coin which is very useful it does put a bit of stress on your rig uh, but you can obviously uh, dual mine Dogecoin is also another one doing very well Steam Zcash wow 262 so overall the, the market is definitely booming uh, once again so very good times to invest in uh, let's say a minor rig if you don't have one although I know there's a shortage on, on the GPUs but I did I made a video yesterday saying that you can start even with one GPU so feel free to go and check it out and of course uh, if you don't want to build or the hustle of doing a minor rig you can obviously go with uh, you know cloud mining companies such as the Genesis Mining which I am also using and if you do want to by the way support me on that program well on that uh, on Genesis Mining uh, feel free to use my 3% discount code which you can use which you can find in the description or in the comment section I will be very grateful for that and feel free to leave me your call as well guys I'll do my best to return the favor as soon as I can uh, one more thing I'm, on, I'm gonna uh, put a link to the team viewer site on the description so uh, you don't have to search for it if you want just uh, you know look into the description you can download it and yeah guys I think it's it's a good program for what uh, what is the intended purpose uh, just to obviously look after the mining rig and see how things are going while on the move or even at home you don't have to obviously connect the monitors to the rigs and all these things very very easy thank you for watching guys hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one Bye-bye for now.